The Variant Now Force mobile application is equipped with an SOS button. In this video, you will learn how to activate and use SOS mode when you are in distress. The SOS activation immediately alerts the control room of your current location and automatically dials the emergency numbers stored in your phone. When SOS mode is activated, you can also share a live video from your phone and chat with the control room. The look of some features might vary depending on the operating system of your mobile phone. To activate an SOS, hold the red button and slide it all the way to the end. To prevent accidental SOS alerts, a countdown timer is activated. You have 5 seconds to cancel the SOS if it was activated accidentally. If the SOS alert is intentional, allow the countdown to complete. Afterward, your device enters SOS mode. First, the emergency number set by the system administrator is dialed automatically. In some cases, you must allow and confirm the automated call. After the call is made, the control room is notified and given your location, including an automatic video stream from your mobile device. You can always enable or disable the video stream by tapping the square button on the corner of the image. You can also turn on the front camera by tapping the flip icon. While in SOS mode, you can chat with the control room to provide more information about your status and receive their updates. To send a message, tap the send button. After you feel safe or are no longer in distress, you can end SOS activation by sliding the red button back to its original position. As a safety precaution to ensure that only the user who sent the SOS activation can end it, enter your password in the pop-up message to authenticate the request. After the password is entered, tap OK. After the SOS activation is ended, the home screen appears. This video described how to activate and use SOS mode in the mobile app. Thank you for watching.